Drench. I want to point out a quick keynote trick that I learned the other day. Now, once you're in Keynote and you've been going through uh, a few slides, maybe it's drastically different than the last round of revisions, or you've taken a dramatically new approach. You might want to create a new copy so that you can always refer back to your old deck to see um, what has changed. It's kind of a, a poor man version control, but I think it's a great way to work because you can always go back to old SAMP, old revisions uh, to see what you might have liked from those, pull different slides, etc. The main problem I've always had with uh, Keynote is that instead of a save as feature, which makes it really easy to create these new versions, they have a duplicate feature, which has always just really confused me. Since I work mostly in PowerPoint, I'm used to save as. Um, and when you do duplicate, you're supposed to just rename it the new window. But um, lo and behold, the, the version that you are duplicating from is still open. So sometimes I've totally confused myself and end up working in this older version. And I don't know what happened, but I'm not a duplicate guy. I'm a save as guy. And thank goodness, the other day, I found a quick hack. When you go to file, hold down your option key on the keyboard, and duplicate turns into save as, which is so much easier for me. It's just the workflow that I'm used to. And it's that easy. Boom, save as for Keynote.